UNB did it. They made it to the UC while remaining undefeated. However, they are not ranked first as they had hoped, and are instead ranked second. UNB now has to battle through the playoffs in hopes of making it to the finals. Their initial obstacle? 1FR. UNB has a significantly larger number of troops deployed on the battleground compared to 1FR. This should make UNB's strategy less complicated, allowing them to take full advantage of their numerical superiority. How will UNB proceed? Let's find out. Once the horn sounds, we will race to all four buildings. Except for the warrior, all initial races will be strong accounts that will, will remain in these buildings. Additionally, we will send a few slow marches as security for the mother. If we capture the warrior, we will swap. This will be our only swap for this round. Perfect, we captured all buildings. Be ready for the next action. As one enemy slow marcher is approaching, be ready to speed in fast upon command. Speed in now. The ports are about to open. We will take Lannister port with a strong account, and others can race for the Targaryen port with a few slow marching. If a strong account takes that port, there will be no swap. If a racer takes it, we will swap. If the enemy takes it, our slow marchers should be able to take that building. It's racing time again. I can do this. What's this? Oh, come on. No, no, no. Nothing to worry. I have this port under control. Be ready to speed in reinforcements. I am about to hand over this port. Speed in now. I prefer castles, but this will do. For now. The protection for Lannister port is nearly ending. Attack this building, we should be able to take this port fast. This defender has infantry weakness as a defense. All infantry and cavalry commanders, go hit it hard. For Casterly Rock, we keep it simple. No swaps, just a couple of strong accounts that will race, with a few slow marches just in case. Take Targaryen port. Take it fast. Fast attacks. Some reinforcements, please, or this building will be lost. Keep on sending reinforcements. This port appears to be under relentless attacks. I think they give up their attacks. That was a good defense. The strongholds are coming up now. We will attempt to capture both of them using our racers, and they can then hold them. We will not initiate a swap, and will only send the minimum necessary reinforcements to maintain control. At the moment, these buildings are not our main priority. Great. I have this building covered. I will keep it as long as needed. Let's try Targaryen port again. 
If we hit our mass, we should get a result. Leave this building to me. The moment the bubble drops, I am going to keep attacking until I've taken it. We have already won this match, and we will easily reach 80,000 points. Let's save our personal heels and boots for the next matches. Since 1FR fought so well, they will get both mines, and we will release all buildings after reaching 80,000 points. Maester, please prepare this message and send it by Raven. At your request, I am presently in the process of crafting this message, which will be dispatched via Raven without delay. Thank you for kind gesture. We greatly appreciate this. Be ready to disband everything. We disband. Now, great job everyone. In the opening match of the UC, UNB secured a comfortable victory, allowing them to conserve their resources for the challenges ahead. With plenty left in the tank, UNB looks poised to make a strong push towards their ultimate objective, the UC Finals. Will UNB be able to maintain this momentum and reach the finals? Stay tuned to find out.